everyone. It's Katerian. Guess what? I'm here. Finally. Um, we are going to do some of the um, entries that I have that I've gotten in. A couple of them are a little over a week old. It, it has been just crazy um, with work. I put in um, probably 10 hours more last week than I'm really supposed to. But things happen, and that's the way it goes. So by the time I get home, I'm, I'm exhausted. But anyway, I'm not complaining. I love it. I love the money. So um, anyway, I want to do the, the um, entries, but I also want to tell you, I actually have, I think, one or two coming from the UK. And... Um, I really want to wait until they get here um, because honestly, I can't remember who messaged me. Terry, I think it was Terry, um, messaged me and told me that she was sending hers. And um, so I'd really like to wait to do hers because I want to add her entry in to the videos before the drawing, if that's all right with everybody. So it'll be a Christmas present for you. And hopefully it'll get here before um, we leave on vacation. But, um, which I'm sure it will. Um, I think it's just the envelope. But she's got an entry here and then she's got my Christmas card that she's sending. But hey, and I gotta tell you something. I sent her a Christmas card and, I, oh, it's going, it's coming from London. So I told her, I said, hey, I'm coming over there in October. Maybe we could meet. Do you know, I put a 49 cent stamp, which is a forever stamp on it. And I told my husband, I said, when you take this in, it's going to need extra postage. They did not. They said, nope, it's fine the way it is. They sent that Christmas card over there with 49 cents. He said, I bet we find it back in the mail again. <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> but anyway, and then I hope she doesn't have to pay postage after she gets it. So, um, anyway, let's go ahead and get started on these. I'm turning my light down just a tad bit. So, these are entries that I just um, purchased. I wrote all over the envelope because that's the only thing that I had uh, to write on. But we were writing books down uh, for the book club. And I never got to tell them about a couple of, or the books or the author that I super love, but, um, you know, that's okay. But anyway, these are from Cheryl's Crafty World dot com, and I um, have to say that, but um, this is just a card, and she, and she says it's for the swap, and um, these are... Uh, the entries to my birthday challenge. Kind of cool to stretch your birthday out for a couple months. But anyways, um, this is, uh, she made these for the Edith Holden. All this down a little bit so you can see it. So look at those red roses. Isn't that pretty? And then I may keep a couple of these for um, my Jane Austen um, journal too. Um, like this one for sure because it's a lighter colors but that's super cool I really like that and then um, here's one I don't know what kind of paper this is but it's like a matte finish paper but it's stiff it's it's heavier kind of cardstock but it's got this really nice matte finish on it and then she's used, you know, Christmas tag on this one. That's got an angel. And then this is, and so these are the um, chipboard um, embellishments that probably go to one of the Christmas papers. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? And then there's a, a um, lantern here with a um, poinsettia. So those are super cool. And then she sent a piece of awesome lace here. Isn't that neat? It's pretty. 
Thank you, Cheryl. Appreciate that. And I'm going to stick that right here in my box that I have all of my entries in. So we have entries here from, from Angela Serendipity. I believe she sent these to me. I think it was her. I'm just sure that's who it was. Um, if I'm wrong, I'm in deep trouble. But this says travel. That's so perfect. But this is a snippet. And um, I thought her and I swapped our snippet. Bleh! Our snippets. <laughs> Already. And maybe we didn't, but I, um, these are super, these are cute little pink flowers. And I'm going to see if I can turn this down just a tad bit more. And it might help if I swap the light out. We'll see how that looks. But this is really bright, bright green. I don't know. Yeah, it looks just like that. So yeah, now you can see the colors really well. So isn't that cute? It's got some metal and some um, really heavy vellum and that. Do what you love. And I've already decided I'm going. I was checking today and I want to go to the High Clear Castle. So we're going right by it. So that will probably go in my Jane Austen. We'll see. And then she's got this little like ATC kind of card here. Are you going to focus? Yeah, it's got a button that she put on there with some um, um, wax. And that, isn't that cute? That's so cute. That would be great for Jane Austen. And then, oh my gosh, this is going in, um, this is going in my um, Edith Holden. It's so Edith Holden. I love it. I wish you would have signed these. Yes, I'm going to have to sign them. And this one, it says Kateri. Doesn't... Uh, let's see. One of these actually has... I think it's... No. One of these I thought had a... Look at that little envelope she made. That is so cute. That's cool. It's got Queen of... Queen Elizabeth on it. Um, yeah, man. I think this is Angela also. It is, because she put the K on here. On top of a bottle uh, cap. That just fits on there just perfect. And then the specimen says B. Because it's got the little honeycomb. Got some vellum back here. And then we have the clear sticker here. I love that. That's cool. It's got mushrooms on it. And then the dried leaves. Oops, sorry. Look at that. Did you do a great job? And then we have the little beehive here on the back. That little piece of paper with the washi tape. Is that a pocket? Oh, is that a pocket? That isn't a pocket. I was hoping that was a pocket. It's not. That's cool, though. I really like that. So thank you. And then my next one is the um, um, Maddie's entry. And um, <laughs> entry. Um, yeah, I told her, I said, hey, you can go in it. Madison can go in it. But anyway, um, this is the little fold out that she had the class on. For those of you that may not know about 
Maddie's store. It's spectrumartcreations.com. Um, and uh, they have a store. They have an Etsy store. And uh, she has classes. And she has live sales every Saturday, except for this past Saturday, on her channel, which is Spectrum Art Creations. And um, anyway, she had to class for this, um, how to do it. And um, so this is her entry to my Edith Holden. Um, she just wanted to make something for me. So she cut out everything. She fussy cut out everything out. And you can make these pockets as it's folded up if you wish. You can just stick something in there. And then it actually will open up backwards. So you have something entirely different. I love this. I am going to make one of these. I have the template for it. So I really would like to have one in the front and one in the back. But I think I see she's got where I can write on this. This is super strong too, you guys. It just sounds like cardboard. But it's not. So yeah, she used a number from the pages, which I like. And she used Edith B. Holden. Almost puts me in mind of my grandfather's, my dad's name. His dad's name was James B. Hobson. Almost. Almost for the exception of this being a B, which that D, this uh, almost a S O N. Okay, so on. So then Madison got into it and she made this cute little pocket. Look at that that I can put in a page. And she layered um, the, um, the back of this. She did, there's three layers here, you guys. So you have the actual layer of, you know, the back weed. Then you have this one here that she fussy cut. Then she has the bird but then you have the paper that's behind it. And I love how how it's torn. The top is torn from the back. I like that. She does a really good job on um, distressing. Super good. And then so you would have a pocket here on the inside. And depending on how you glue it, for those of you that don't know this, you glue on three sides, leave the top open, and that gives you another pocket. Or you glue here, here, and here, and then you have a pocket coming from the side. So that's a little sparrow. So cute. Thank you, Madison. I like it a lot. It's very, very sweet of you to do that. Oh, yeah, and they even stamped, look, Madison, even, she even signed it. I hate to cover that up. I may have to think something else. What I could do is, since this is flat on this side, I could put washi tape down through here and use it as a flip. Because it's got Madison's signature back here. Oh, and they've got their own stamp. So, um, yeah, I might just do that. And I can always add something here if I want to. I could do, yeah, I'll figure something out. Do something kind of special. Alrighty, so that is that. And I know everybody's been saying, did you get my stuff? Did you get my, he's like, yes, but I haven't done a video yet. I haven't had time. So... We have those. I think I'm going to run out of room in my little box here. So um, that are the entries that I have. So that is probably, I have to, it's been a while since I looked at the last video. I want to say these are like, um, I need to get these back out. So... 
that doesn't count. But um, that would be, I think, 10, 11, 12, 13. Oh, wait a minute. 12. I think, you guys. So there's about 13. In, this would be the 13th entry. This one. I believe. I believe. I believe. I better put those over there. And this. So. Um, anyway. Um, I will do another video when Terry's gets here and um, we, um, and then I'll do the drawing. So give it um, at the latest, at the latest. Where's my phone? Where's my phone? Where's my phone? Okay, so we're gonna go into here. I'm going to December. So, today is the 6th. I'm shooting for maybe the 17th, maybe drawing on the 18th, something like that. And, um, yeah, somewhere around there. So, give it another, you know, week and a half, and I'll go ahead and do the drawing. But I do know Terry's is coming. Um, I just kind of wanted to get the video done before the drawing. So, um, anyway, that's, I'm going to put a note in here that we'll do it at noonish. Oh, I need a plus. So, drawing for, for, I'm just going to do birthday C or BC. I better know what that is. Okay, so, and it's not going to start at 7 p.m. I need to do it at 12 p.m. Okay, there you go. So, it's in there. It will, it will let me know. Alrighty, so we will see you in it, and stay tuned because... I'm going to show the Christmas cards that I have as of now, and then I have two hauls that, um, one from Maddie, they're not big, and one from Cheryl that I need to do. So Cheryl's actually just got here, and I think she sent it on the 24th of November. So it's taken a while to get here, which is kind of ridiculous, but um, she's not that far away from me. It probably went way of Washington to Arizona to Oklahoma and then here. Who knows? So we'll see you later. Thanks for coming in. Bye-bye.